Hey guys, Mr. Robert SM10 here, and today I'm unboxing Call of Duty Ghosts, the uh, Hardened Edition. Hooray, Call of Duty! Let's get started. Um, yeah, this game just got released in Australia. Well, it got released this morning. And yeah, at the midnight launch, I'm pretty sure it was. Uh, yeah. This game looks alright. It's a Call of Duty game, so they're all entertaining. Battlefield, but it's fine. Anyway, there you go. It's nice. Nice Call of Duty thing. Let's take this off. So it's just like a thing to tell you what's in it. I'll be looking at that to tell you what we've got. Alright, so it's got nice art on it. It's actually a really nice box. That's what it looks like on the back. This side is just. Yeah. So if we just. Okay. So it's nothing in there. Alright, so. Steelbook case. That's what I like to see. These are my favourite things in the world. Absolutely love them. And yeah. It's a collectible steelbook case. So, might as well. I know I'm gonna cut myself, but oh well. Oh well. Um, this will be the last unboxing video for a while, guys, because there's not many, really that many cool games coming out. Uh, yeah. So tell me in the comments what you would like to see more of, like gameplay or some stuff like that. Or games, I guess. Yeah, this is taking too long to get off. There we go. Beautiful. And that is a draw opening next door. That's fine. Get off. It's really sticky. Alright, so the game will be in here, so um, it's got the DLCs and all that. Okay, uh, in the um, in this, we've got a um, collect uh, collectible steelbook, a um, season pass that has four DLC map packs, a bonus team leader digital pack. Um, we got a paracord strap, that looks pretty cool, I'm thinking that's this thing here. Um, and we got free for all dynamic bonus map, um, bonus collector's edition digital content is a player patch, um, player's card, player background, and official soundtrack. All right, sweet. All right, so I'll just open this off screen so that you guys can't see any codes. Oh yeah, that's just. Um, where's the code? Well, this is. Hang on. Alright, here are the codes. Alright, you won't be able to see them. <coughs> Alright, so we got this thing. It's a Destiny pre order thing, me bob. Uh, yeah. This was on top. On top of that part. Um, what else we got? Get all this stuff out of the way. Yeah. Oh. We have we've got a bonus digital content. The um the thing the code is on the back. But yeah, that's got your um all that junk, all that stuff, and the season pass thing. But the codes are. Alright, so it's just the codes on the back. Again. There you go. Beautiful. So, uh, let's 
just the DLC stuff. There's a dog. Because he gets plays the dogs in this game, maybe? I can't remember. And then, yeah, the, um, oh, then the two games, uh, game disc and install disc, that's pretty nice looking, um, they've done actually a really good job with the art here, so if you kind of see that, there you go, stick this back in here so it doesn't get damaged. Yeah, so that's that part. Pretty nice look. I do like this. I really like the steel bookcases. And then we got our friend over here. Oh god! Don't want to break anything. Nothing else in there. Nah, that is actually the box. Feels really nice. They have done a very good job with this. I like it. Right, uh, this is the, what's it called again? The paracord strap. Let's open this bad boy up. Now this is only the hardened edition. There is one step up from that. Um, can't remember what that one's called. But yeah, it was really expensive, over $200 in Australia. So yeah, Let's get that one. That's nice. It's like that furry, furry stuff that you can sometimes get. Um, the paracord thing is like people um, using the army and they just like put it around their wrist. And supposedly you can actually untie this and use it as a rope. And I'm not going to do that because that would ruin the whole thing. So it's, it probably won't even fit me. Oh no, it does. I just don't know how to stick it on. Um, if I can somehow get it. Maybe we need two people. I don't know if you're more skilled than I am. Good luck with you, but there we go. It's actually, I'll just stick it on that. It's just in a shape that is really awkward. Yeah, I could go to the next one if I really wanted to, but yeah. There you go. It's got three sizes that you can adjust to. It's pretty cool, I guess. And it's, it said like the soundtrack or something? Maybe it's a uh, it might be a digital soundtrack, but there's the symbol thing that that's really nice. I like this thing. It's pretty cool. Alright. Let's put this back on. I'll look for the soundtrack because the Assassin's Creed one actually had a disc. Um, oh yeah. Here it is. That's the soundtrack there. That's pretty stupid. It doesn't have its own disc. But... Uh, I'm not complaining, that's fine. That is actually a really good pack. I like that. Um, it looks like a pretty fun game, because all of the Call of Duty games are fun. They're just, yeah. Even the story might be good. Dunno. I haven't really watched anything about the, the game, so. Anyway, guys, um, so let's just have a brief recap of what we've got here. We got a very nice box. Art, the, oh, the art is really nice. Um, we got a paracord strap, very nice too, I like it. We got another box with the uh -oh. steel bookcase, probably my favorite thing in the whole thing. Um, whatever that is, digital, oh, bonus digital content, and see. Season pass, I nearly showed you the code, didn't I? And the season pass. Alright, guys, I hope you have enjoyed this unboxing video. I hope it's showed you that you should buy Call of Duty. No sponsor, just it looks like a pretty good game. And yeah, 
So uh, I guess uh, like, favorite, subscribe, and I'll see you later, guys. Bye.